One day after the lifting of a nearly 90-year-old ban on women wearing the Islamic headscarf in Turkey's state institutions, and the issue remains as divisive as ever. Being religious or secular dictates the response. For Turkey's prime minister, it's a positive move and one of his reforms meant to improve democracy. A painful ban that has caused a lot of suffering to the parents of young people is lifted. A dark era has come to an end. The decades-old ban has kept many women from joining the public workforce. Supporters of the scarf see the change as the restoration of freedom of religious expression. This teacher says, according to the former regulation, if you wore a headscarf, you could receive a warning and a reprimand within a certain period. Nothing else was said. It was done without even asking us to explain ourselves. But Erdogan's critics see his Islamist-rooted AK party as seeking to erode the secular foundations of the republic. Ilkner, who lives in Istanbul, says this is not good. I can't even imagine a civic officer wearing a headscarf. This was not the right decision to take and I don't approve of it. The lifting of the ban forms part of the government-named democratization package revealed last week, which also includes measures to bolster the rights of Turkey's Kurdish community.